ladies how you guys been holding up we still at home as you can see i'm at my house and today i have another unit for you guys this one been holding up pretty well i've been wearing it with a headband just you know took the glue out about after i'll say two weeks took the glue out so she's been holding up pretty good um i know a lot of you guys been complaining no eyelashes no nothing we can't go nowhere we still stuck at home but we can still look good we can still get dressed and up. it's a braided wig so let's see how she looks we doing the passion twist wig today um it's in an ombre 33 which is like more of a copper like a three i would say more of a 350. this one's an ombre copper so it's dark roots and then you see the lace so it has all the natural parts in it you can part it so it has a four by four four by four closure in the front that you can part anywhere so whether you want to do a side part or a middle part and as you know i always have pictures at the end of these videos so definitely stay tuned <laughs> um this is this cutie right here this one is called um it's by project 879 and it's by bohemian this wig is actually called bomb twist and this color they call it tt autumn tt autumn right. is the color so wig is definitely coming off here we go me and my small head does not help behind this blank wall right here but <laughs> let's try her on oh my gosh from brown to black is like whoa okay i like this you guys i've been home <laughs> like i've been home in the house most of the days so my skin did get lighter um and with this black hair it makes me look even lighter which is like a definite whoa i should have put like a darker color lipstick or something but um this is the wig so it's a little past the shoulder i will say about 16 inch it's um passion twist and they are nicely made like you know it's not too chunky and then you have your part in the front where you could just move it around and then it comes with the little baby hair that we could always you know gel down and push to the side so um i mean i like this color from going brown like honey blonde to a natural black ombre you know definitely as always they these colors gonna have to grow on me because i mean the transition is like really drastic but i like it so far so let's cut the lace do my part gel down these little baby hair all righty so we back and i went ahead and cut the lace on the wig so i cut it as close as possible to the hairline without you know cutting it off if you guys could see i'm gonna try to put it against the wall the baby hair is here and the baby hair is not the smoothest baby hair this one is actually really nappy but you know for passion twist because it's more of a natural look i think this would work but it's not like straight baby hair with curls at the end like i had with the last one this baby hair is actually kinky and nappy but still straight it's like a kinky straight type of baby hair <laughs> all right and one thing i noticed this wig comes with an elastic band already attached now the thing with the elastic band i always let people know is that if it's too big for you don't cut the whole band out cut it in the middle and just sew in 
you know, and just connect it and sew it back together. Um, when you cut it towards the end, it's harder to find where it's placed. And sometimes you ended up sewing it on the lace where you, put, you know, make a hole in it, trying to stretch it out. But measure it, pull the band, and get the tightness that you want. Cut it off and then just connect the two bands together. Um, it does have a comb in the back. It also has two combs in the front. You guys could see has two combs in the front. It's a four by four with a frontal. And you could part, like I said before, anywhere in the front. And I mean, the twists are neatly put together. So it's not like super loose at the base and then super, you know, nice and um, neat towards the end. Like from top to bottom, it's nice and neat and you could actually go in and move it around. Um, this wig is very lightweight. It's not heavy at all. Like it's really, really extremely lightweight. Um, I have it in my hand now and I mean, it, it's really lightweight. It looks like a lot of hair, but it's really, really light. So I like definitely like that part about it because summer is like right around the corner and it's about to get hot. So let's put her back on. Oh. I have a small hair, so let me adjust my band and make it a little bit tighter so it could stay. I might not have to, actually I'm not gonna glue it because this is gonna be one of the wigs that I'm gonna take on and off. But if you do decide to do ponytails and updo with this unit, I would definitely glue it down or put some got to be, um, got to be glue or got to be wig spray on it just to hold it in place. But it's pretty tight. Let me take out these baby here. And I like my side part, so let me adjust it to how I want it. There you go. Yeah, you can see these baby here are not straight. These baby actually look just like my edges. Because <laughs> that's exactly how my edges look like. <laughs> exactly. So you have the option to do a middle part. Which would be something like this. And I haven't even done nothing with it yet. Like this is just on my head. I didn't even stick the combs in. All I did was tighten up the back of it. And it's on. Ta-da! <laughs> I could be done right now. Middle part. This is really nice. And then if I want a side part. Just shift it a little bit. Because, you know, me, I like my heavy side. So... guys i have no lashes on right now so my eyes just look bare i should have put an eyeliner or something but i'm home we are home so it is what it is <laughs> but this unit is actually really nice like it feels light when i say i mean it feels really really light this unit feels like we're like look at it it's i mean it's so light i like this color this color is definitely gonna grow on me i really like this color all right so okay. let's go ahead and get started with these ba with the baby hair um what you're gonna need is your got to be yeah look crazy is your got to be spray i mean got to be gel my bad you can use the spray also but for this one if this is gonna be one of the ones i'm probably gonna take on and off um just because like it's so lightweight and it's so easy to just throw on in the morning i don't think i should keep it on yeah i mean for people who like to glue their wigs down 
you could do that because once you glue it down you could actually get some really nice styles out of it um okay. so for this unit we're gonna just fix the baby hair and you know pluck it up fix the baby hair cut a little bit if we need to and gel it down with a got to be i don't have my edge brush but this brush will work just the same um so let's get started so i'm gonna start off by actually i'm gonna keep it as the middle part so i'm gonna style it so how i want it first so i'm gonna style it in the middle part all right so once i style it i'm gonna push it back a little bit pull the baby hair down Okay, um, I'm going to trim the ends. It's mainly like the rough edges of the baby hair. I'm going to trim that off. Just, you know, a little clip just towards the end. Yeah, just the ends. And I mean, once you get this unit, you will feel the rough edges towards the end. So I got my baby hair trim. I'm gonna gather my got to be glue. We're gonna lay it right across. And I did say I want I want um a middle part, so let me lay my middle part down. before I decide on which way I want these baby ears to be swinging. <laughs> okay, so middle part is laid. Get your edge brush or whatever brush you have at the moment. Like I said, these baby hair are not smooth. Um, they are on the rougher side of things. So just take your time. I mean, if you like, you could actually go in and pluck some of these baby hair out if it's too thick for you, but I like thick edges, not too thick, just a little thick. Since this one, I'm only doing the middle part. I'm only gonna do it towards the front. If I was doing a ponytail or something, I would probably go all the way down. So this is all I'm doing because this wig is going to be hanging down. So as you can see, there's some edges here. There's some edges here. Edges are not perfect, but this unit is really nice. I mean, one style I could do right now is just take it. So I take about 
four twists each on each side. It don't have to be neat, it don't have to be perfect. I take it around the back, just like this, and I tie it in a knot. No bobby pins, no rubber bands, no combs, just tie it in a knot. Look at that. No glue, no tape, no got to be spray, just no bleaching knots, no tinting the lace, no. All I did was put a brown cap, put the wig on, cut the lace off, and there she goes. I mean, like, this is nice. This is really nice. Okay, you guys have no reason to be like, oh my God, I can't get my hair done. Hello, grab a wig. It helps. <laughs> Especially on my bad hair days, especially when I don't feel like doing anything. It helps. Okay, this definitely helps. So, this is her. And again, I will give you guys the info. Um, my baby hair there. My scalp. <laughs> the wig scalp. My 4x4 laces in there. My part, my braid, like everything is just... Like, I love this color yeah from going blonde to this at first i was like whoa especially with no eyelashes on but i actually like this color it's this is a nice color this is a really really nice color so that's it for you guys this is it. again this is by bohemian and it's called bomb twist and the color is tt autumn and it's by bohemian um, this wig is passion twist. I would say about mm, 18 inches, like 16 to 18 inches because it is layered. So 16 to 18 inches is very lightweight. I mean, lightweight, like very, very lightweight. Um, it has a natural scalp. The twists are really nice and neat. I mean, really nice and neat. I mean, really nice and neat. <laughs> like, this could be crochet. This could be handmade. This is a really nice wig. And it's short. I mean, most passion twist wigs be so long and heavy and just all over the place. This one is thin at the top. It's short. It's lightweight. I'm in love. Like... <laughs> I love this wig. Like, I'm going to be rocking. You guys are going to see me in this one often. Especially with the fact that I don't have to glue it down. I could just throw it on and just go. Oh, yeah. She's going to be... She's definitely one of my favorites. Definitely, definitely one of my favorites. Again, Bomb Twist. Bomb Twist is her name. Bomb Twist. So definitely go check it out. Try it for yourself. Let me know what you think on the comments after you try it. They have a few different colors. They have the natural colors with no color. They have the ombre 613 if you want to, you know, step out the box. I mean, She's as you amazing. guys know, I'm going to have some pictures at the end of this video. So let me know what you think. Try it out for yourself. Try to stay in the house as much as you guys can and just be safe. So see you guys soon with another unit. But Bomb Twist, I'm definitely going to be rocking doing this stay at home order until things go back to normal. Bye. See you guys soon.